on the Carajás Railway in northern Brazil runs the longest cargo train in the world. At the heart of this extreme railway operation lie a series of ingenious inventions that avert disaster. Nós teríamos um risco de colocar um trem em circulação contra o outro. Today, these inventions will help workers overcome six critical challenges as they haul 30,000 tons of ore from the largest open cast iron mine on earth to the colossal carrier, the CSB Brilliant. Não pode ter erro. Ele tem que sair no tempo previsto. The challenge begins. They must beat the countdown. On the edge of the Amazon rainforest, in northern Brazil, sprawls the Carajás mine, the largest open cast iron mine on earth. There's 7.2 billion tons of iron ore in the ground here, enough to make the steel to build 40,000 Empire State Buildings. Transporting the ore out of here takes a very special machine. The world's longest, most extreme train. In just 30 minutes time, it's 330 wagons, 2,688 wheels, and 7,400 tons of steel will start rolling. The driver of this railroad monster is Abadou Fran Francis de Souza. Eu sou o responsável pelo trem. A partir do, do momento em que nós partimos, na nossa estrada de ferro Carajás. Vamos observar se as sapatas de freios estão bem alocadas, se não está não faltando nenhuma. Não pode estar é, nada fora do lugar aqui. Tem que estar tudo certinho para a gente viajar. This enormous train is 3.4 kilometers long, the length of 38 soccer pitches. Abadu is relying on this extraordinary engineering feat to get him safely to his destination. Okay, cumpri o sinal, boa viagem para nós. Deus acompanhe, tá bem? Once he's filled its carriages with ore, Abadou will embark on a truly epic journey. From the mine in Carajás, he must guide the train through 900 kilometers of remote grassland and Brazilian jungle to reach the South Atlantic port at São Luís. Arriving at the port is the newly commissioned CSB Brilliant. This 330 meter long Leviathan needs loading with over 300,000 tons of iron ore. The ore is destined for China, where it will be turned into steel to build skyscrapers, ships and bridges. In charge of loading the ship is Augusto Cesar Megales. Ele atracou duas horas antes do pré-amar e tem uma, uma janela para, para manobrar na, na saída dele. Ele tem que sair no tempo previsto. The CSB Brilliant must set sail tomorrow by 7 p.m. sharp to hit the tidal window. Augusto is relying on the train to deliver the final 30,000 tons of ore. It has just 36 hours to reach the port at São Luís and unload. The countdown clock is ticking. The railway's workers face six critical challenges to get the train to its destination on time. First challenge, load the train with iron ore. Giant trucks and massive conveyor belts shuttle the ore to the stockpile. From here, three huge loading silos drop the ore into the wagons that pass beneath. Filling up this behemoth is no easy feat. O grande problema da gente carregar um vagão aí acima do peso é a gente danificar o vagão, danificar o sistema dele de amortecimento, o sistema dele de suspensão normal. Isso pode acarretar descarrilhamentos no sistema, pode acarretar quebra de trilho. 
The task of loading the wagons today rests on the shoulders of trainee operator Rita Brito dos Santos. With just two months experience, Rita must manually load each wagon precisely and quickly enough to get the train away on time. É uma, uma responsabilidade muito grande, né? Pra gente. Principalmente eu que sou novata aqui, é uma responsabilidade maior ainda. To help Rita load the right amount of ore into each car, she's relying on an ingenious machine. The automatic loading silo. It uses special sensors to weigh the cars as they fill up. Train driver Abadu steers the first wagons under the silo. He must keep the train rolling at an even 1.5 km per hour while Rita loads the train, making her job even tougher. Então por isso que eu tenho que ter bastante tempo para que eu não possa fazer nada de errado. Pode descarrilhar, né? Não pode por ser. In 1997, it did happen. Bexley, England. A freight train carrying hundreds of tons of stone careered off the tracks, smashing through workshops. One of the cars was overloaded. The excess weight caused the track to splay apart, pulling the load over. Miraculously, nobody was killed, although four people were badly injured. To avoid horrific accidents like this, each car on the world's longest train has a carefully calculated target weight, which it cannot exceed. Sensors in the sleepers and tracks leading into and out of the silo tell the team the exact weight of each car before and after loading. The team must hit a 100 ton target for each wagon. Esse é um valor essencial e importante para que garanta aí a segurança do carregamento. To fill every wagon with just the right amount of ore, the loading silo must weigh each load accurately. Giant hoppers release the ore into weigh bins below. Load sensors measure the weight of ore in the weigh bins and close the hopper doors when the load reaches its target weight. As the train passes below, operators discharge the ore from the first two weigh bins to half fill a pair of wagons. The weigh bins recharge, and the next two bins top up the wagons to the correct amount. Esse sistema é de fundamental importância para que a gente tenha aí o um controle de peso médio do vagão. Quanto mais estável a gente tiver e quanto mais preciso a gente for, mais eficiente a gente vai ser no carregamento desse vagão, no transporte do minério daqui até São Luís. With just four hours to load 30,000 tons of iron ore, the team have their work cut out. A gente tem que fazer o mais rápido possível, porque a gente tem uma meta. É um desafio pra gente. With 200 of the 330 wagons loaded, Rita can't afford to lose focus. Pode haver algum problema na comporta ou ela ficar aberta. E se acontecer isso, pode cair minério na linha do trem. E se cair, pode descarrilhar. Hoje estamos chegando no final de mais um dia é, de uma meta bastante arrojada. A turma trabalhou muito bem, o sistema funcionando perfeitamente. Rita fills the final wagon, bang on schedule. Pode marcar o término do minério do silo 3, pode seguir em paz, câmbio. Tá pronto, procedimento checado, tá pronto para circular. Train driver Abadu can finally haul the world's longest train, laden with 30,000 tons of cargo, out of Carajaz. Challenge 1 complete. But the race to reach the port is just beginning. 
This is the Cargo Train Network's nerve center. Workers here coordinate more than 6,500 train journeys each year. The Karajas Railroad is almost entirely single track line. It's critical they monitor the position of every train moving along the remote railway with precision. In charge is Supervisor Rodrigo Belchior Beraldo. Nossa missão é garantir que esse minério seja bem conduzido até os navios e, consequentemente, aos clientes aí mundo afora. Então, é praticamente um carrossel que a gente tem que manter aqui é, é a circulação ferroviária, como se fosse uma esteira de transporte. Então, um dever de casa muito grande garantir que essa circulação desses trens possa acontecer com segurança. The team now have just 32 hours to track the treacherous 900 kilometers. For Rodrigo, the next challenge looms large on the control center's giant screen. Just 20 kilometers separate the Carajaz train from an empty train heading back towards it on the single track line. 